Okay, let's see if I remember to do that when this movie's over. Yeah, another. S I love when we start our movie with a big sexual innuendo. <laughs> oh, cameraman shadow. Okay, uh, for some reason the credits of this movie are in Spanish. I don't know why, but the movie's called Horror Express. It's got Christopher Lee, Peter Cushing. It's from 1974. Uh, yeah. Got some good... Motherfucker. You know what's funny is you were muted that whole time. Say that again. <laughs> I said that I keep forgetting that Peter Cushing was in more than just Star Wars. <laughs> yeah, dude, he was also, you know, I always know him as the famous fearless vampire killer that was uh, the inspiration of Peter Vincent from Fright Night, you know. I always think of From Dust Till Dawn with Sex Machine. We're talking about, yeah. like, crosses. I mean, <laughs> you can put two sticks together and get a cross, and then Sex Machine's like, yeah, Peter Cushing does that all the time. And it's like, honestly, though, I don't think that does work. I think vampires, you need a crucifix. It needs to have, like, literally, like, Jesus on it. Yeah, really. Maybe. I don't know. I really wish I could, uh, yeah, he's with Kazan? I don't know. Uh, Sesterio Actoris. <laughs> this is like Spanish Spanish. Yeah, really. What is this language? Foto Fija. <laughs> Simon Lopez. Anyway, I like these lens flares. This was like a 70s thing where it was like, back or in the JJ. day, <laughs> in the 60s and 50s, if you got a lens flare, you would have to like stop Relight, reprint, reshoot, do it again. A lens flare was like considered a technical error. And I think it was only until the 70s with like William Friedkin and some of these other directors that were really going for this like realism documentary vibe. That's when all of a sudden lens flares started being like okay. Yeah. And let alone like encouraged, but definitely enjoying this cool optical. Uh, I, just, I just don't get like why JJ has to like encourage it every fucking thing he does. What's yeah, the point, dude? yeah. Just uh, it just I adds see. more uh, noise, and it's cool because like the thing about lens flares is they move with the camera, so they help like add motion to the frame. And the way like J you know JJ would use the lens flares, like especially in like the Star Trek, uh, Star Trek Nine. Like I don't, I prefer the old ship, obviously with even lighting. Yeah. But there's no doubt that the uh, Star Trek lighting on Star Trek Nine is just so much more like dramatic. <laughs> okay, what the hell? These are some following report to the Royal Geological Society. China. 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 Is it okay. It comes from China. Of events that befell the society. Is that Christopher Lee himself, the man, the myth, the legend, the heavy metal singer? It is. Oh. Of the expedition. Hmm. I must yeah, goddamn. Man was in so many fucking movies. I must disaster. accept responsibility. But I will leave to the judgment yeah. of the honorable and members. Ending disaster. The de Get that. As to where the blame for the catastrophe, the catastrophe lies. Oh boy. Lies. Drop this quality, so yeah. Ain't no buffering issues. There he is, Count Dooku himself. <laughs> <laughs> Where? Yeah, China man. Okay. Please, Asian American man. I know what I said. I know what I said. He's from China. It's like Hispanics or Latinos or Latinx. It's like, dude, they're, they're Mexicans. They're from Mexico. It's like, not all of them. Most of them. Sorry. <laughs> a Spanish man. I would never confuse a Spanish man for a Mexican. Yeah. And then there's like South American dudes, like Brazilians, like, like they speak Portuguese. Like they're not, yeah. they're not Mexicans at all. So why do we gotta lump them in with Mexicans? Just call them all Latinos, call them all Hispanics. It's like what the fuck? It's weird. <laughs> yeah. It's actually more racist. Yeah. I love seeing different people talk about that. The whole Latinx thing, how they keep doing polls ah! and more. The hell? It's a creepy skeleton. See, I don't understand. Like, how do you decompose in the snow like that? Did his, did he, was his face? He got some pretty bad frostbite before he died, basically. Yeah. That's kind of the point. Is they was that even decompose. a human? <laughs> like, oh. some kind of <laughs> monster? It looked like the fucking. Uh, I mean, I hate to say it, but it was what's the Star Trek caveman uh, Bigfoot thing? Star Star Wars. What's that big thing called? Oh God, yeah, I should know this too. Yeah, I know. With a wampas? No. Uh, is it a Wampa? Yeah. I know Wampa is Star Wars. I have to look it up now. 
There's like For sure, I, there's Wampa. There's there's the Bigfoot, and then there's the Bigfoot uh, thing that he eats. The little lamb, the little uh, animal. God damn it. We're over here nerding yep. out, trying to figure oh, out really. the name of the... Okay, Wampa, good. Yep, it is a, is a Wampa, yep. <laughs> God. You know, there's a joke uh -huh. I always say. It's like, there's people who... Um, there's two types of nerds, you know? People who uh, who like Bit Fortuna, and yep. people who even know who the fuck Bit Fortuna is. You know what I mean? Like... If I tell you Bit Fortuna oh, yeah. and you know Bitty Witty Wonka or whatever the fuck, then you're a nerd. You're a nerd. Can't you see? I'm on a very strict timeline. My mustache simply has no time for your pain. Incompetence. Tell me how the gray hair works out like that. It's like only a certain side to his head. <laughs> There's Peter Cushing. There's the two fucking legendary vampires and vampire hunters uh, shaking hands. Professor Alexander Saxton. He dabbles in fossils and bones. That's where I, that's just, I still love when how when Star Wars came out and wanted to take it seriously. Like Peter Cushing, like, was he refused to wear pants for the first Star Wars? He dabbles. Dabbles in fossils and bones. Whoa, that guy needs to poop. He's making a face. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hmm. Maybe I could go. Oh, I guess they are in China, right? So yeah. Of, so, the, so they're China men. Transoriental. <laughs> geez, some kind of transoriental uh, trainway, tra railway. Yeah. But also, they have something. Yeah. There's obviously a box and they got a bunch of, you know. Yeah. Whatever that. Shit. Whatever that frozen creature was. Oh, great. What is he unlocking? Is doing, this dude? really a monster movie? I thought this was gonna be a like a murder on the Orient Express type film. Two private compartments, two Moscow. You're gonna find out. Do you say? Hmm. Will that be all? And three crates. Will that be all? Oh, I got three crates of animals too. By the way. Huh. <laughs> Anything else? Oh yeah. I like how it's like how many animals are in these crates. You could have three yeah, crates really. with three animals, or you could have three crates with like three hundred animals. Be a real asshole. It's true. I've got three crates, huh. each with a hundred ferrets stuffed inside. Yeah. They're all crawling over each other. They're very unhappy. Oh, oh whoa. Somebody got killed. Yeah. Or maybe they just store the railway bodies there. Like, all the people that jump in front of the train, they just stack them up. Whoa. Thank you. Why are his eyes white for him? White eyes. Oh, no. We call it bribery and corruption. <laughs> Like that. In Britain, we call it bribery and corruption. <laughs> These Chinese places aren't nearly as dignified as the Queen's land. <laughs> Sir Alexander Saxton. Those are some cheery colored yes. uniforms. Captain O'Hagan, sir. <laughs> Look at his little salute. <laughs> With his little yeah. toes, his little heels <laughs> clicking. He said General Wang. <laughs> Dude, that was my favorite thing about Big Trouble in Little China is like they say the word Wang like a thousand times. <laughs> Come on, Wang. That's done on purpose. And then my cat Mao Yin. <laughs> Her name is. What in the devil's going on here? And the Lord have mercy on his soul. And he's uh, <laughs> saying a prayer for him. Yeah. Okay. You have his things? Doesn't deserve your God. The price of the pay of the prayer is uh, I get to take your shoes and whatever the contents of your wallet is. You can open any, any lock with a hairpin. Okay. But he was blind. Blind? He could spot a policeman hmm. a mile away. I mean, to be blind faith. Yeah, to be fair, you know, most of the police seem to be English dudes. Yeah. Okay. The devil. It's always the devil. <laughs> I mean, the guy's got some crazy white eyes. Can I be of any assistance, Father? Back to what's in the box. This is yours. It is, but I demand an explanation. Whatever you have. I just look at the. What's the point of having a hat that big? Like it doesn't keep your head that much more warm. <laughs> Maybe. 
it prevents hat hair? I don't know. <laughs> I mean, it just adds the illusion of height, maybe? Inspector Mural. Yeah. And it's like it doesn't even cover your ears, which is like the most vulnerable part of yeah, exactly. you know, the cold. Like, what are those those little stupid uh, beanies that have the little Stop. ear covers? Like, those are... Yes. Yeah. Like That's... Gold. Gold. It's a yeah. It's like, yeah, your, your ears and your fingertips and your, um, to uh, your toe tips, too, always the first to go. It was a cold Chinese night <laughs> on a dark, dark on railroad. Floor, just so. What is he drawing? He's just drawing it with a crack rock. There's no place for the cross. I mean, Satan is, right is evil. Wow, how profound. <laughs> I'm glad this new information helps the case. <laughs> I mean, that is pretty cool, I guess. Rubbish. So he can't... He can't draw a cross on the box with the chalk. All right. Huh. I like how he just immediately just hands his coat to some guy. Like, yeah, he's so used to having servants. <laughs> Here. Lift it up. Off you go. Yep. No. That Chinese dead guy was pretty light. Also, if he unlocked the, if he unlocked the crate, then how did it get locked again? Robert De Niro in an early role. Really? No. I, 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 I wasn't sure if you're serious. Like, Looks a little bit like him. He, he really, but shit. You're not joking. <laughs> Old dudes on a train. The movie. I would definitely like to hang out next to the little, uh, little wood coal furnace there. Yeah, I'm sure it's probably nice and warm. <laughs> Just have a little, little chair. Read a little book. Yeah. <laughs> That's what you did back then. There wasn't no, was no smartphones. Yep. Those uniforms, man. It's like they all blew themselves. <laughs> was that a noise? I think I heard a noise. I, I heard something for sure. Exactly. <laughs> Definitely sounded like some kind of creature in there. The clocks are to keep whatever's in there from breaking out. It's not about keeping someone from breaking in. Of course, let me open this thing, see what's going on. Yeah. Why don't I just stick my whole head in there? No bars or nothing? No screen? Oh, shit, it's still, like, frozen. Okay, so it's like some dead animal. So how is it going to come alive? Not to mention, um... Yeah. Shouldn't it be melting now? I like how he didn't even react. He just kind of walked. I mean, he's just like, well, that's, yep. He's still looking hideous. Still a disgusting yeah. dead creature. Dead, oh. dead. Oh. Is it a Yeti? Is that what he found? Is it like an abominable snowman? Dude, that'd be actually pretty cool if this is a movie about a Chinese frozen <laughs> abominable snowman that defrosts on a train and starts killing everybody. <laughs> Please tell me that's what this movie is about. That's a that's a good concept. I'm surprised no one has made that movie yet. <laughs> I think I think we're about to get our wish right now. He's <laughs> locking it again. Yeah, can I look at the fucking frozen monkey creature? I want to see. Why are, you, why are you the only one allowed to see this thing? But you've got something live in there. I heard it. Is it another one of your fossils and bones that you dabble with? The occupant hasn't eaten in two million years. That's one way to economize on food bills. Huh. busting his balls. Yeah, did you hear? That's what the, I feel like the fucking press secretary of the White House is going to say that any day. Hey, just don't eat for two, two thousand years. Yes, Countess. You have a Are we all right with the inflation? Yes, I shall make out the receipt. Still, I'm just like, um, more concerned. There's no refrigeration system, so shouldn't it be thawing out it right now? It is thawing. I'm sure it's dripping yeah. disgusting smelling water all over the place. <laughs> exactly. I sure hope nothing happens to that cute dog or this pretty lady who is, like, fucking old enough to be Chris Christopher Lee's 
fucking grandfa granddaughter by the looks of it. Yeah. Normally she likes Englishmen. Queen Victoria. Crumpets. Something's wrong with the dog. You always listen to the dog. Dogs? Yeah, they got good instinct. If I had a dog yeah, and my dog was all worried about you, I would be worried about you too. <laughs> exactly. Who are you? Are you the devil? The dog knows. It's still whining too. Jesus. Dog's really upset. Yeah, dog just doesn't like being, uh... Oh god, that dog wants the hell out of there. Oh, it's because he smells the monkey! The gorilla thing! The yeti! I wonder what it is. Maybe he smells beef jerky. <laughs> I escort you back to your carriage. Yeah, I wonder it's what's... It smells delicious. <laughs> I mean, there's like all these animal pelts and cages here, so obviously the dog is like freaking out about something in there. Just get it out of there. Ooh, I like how they rubbed uh, crotches on each other when they passed. I mean, we've, we've all been there. It was the gentleman <laughs> way. Like, why don't we both face the walls and we cross ass to ass? Yours? Oh, My crack rock! I was looking everywhere for this. <laughs> say, that's a small chess piece, holy shit. I was on the platform before when that mad monk was carrying on. Would you like to play some chess? No. I'm an engineer. A scientist. I don't need to see your card, dude. I'm a scientist too. This is ordinary chalk. How do you explain mm. it's not writing on that crate? You said it's ordinary chalk. Hypnosis. It's yoga. You said it, no, it, yoga. So seriously, that's like a big deal that that guy couldn't write chalk <laughs> on the crate? Who cares? Like, we're still talking about that? Yeah, this would probably freak me out, but... No. No. <laughs> I'm just curious how you said yoga. Like, wow. Who will pay for it, sir? Hey, yoga's been around for a while. <laughs> Since at least the 1970s. <laughs> yeah, man. Just, uh, let me look in this giant double lock chained up crate that uh, my buddy's super protective of. My talks, huh? Is that a model train? I think it is. I suppose maybe they couldn't go out. Maybe they need a specifically like an older train? I don't know. I'm always conflicted about these old movies that have hot babes in them because I know these these hot babes yeah. are like super old ladies now are dead. Yes. Yeah. It's the same thing with like porn stars who have all died of like suicide or drug overdoses. It's like, eh. Um. I'm so glad you're thinking I was about to say it, but I don't, I don't want to be creepy, so... No, August Ames, R.I.P., <laughs> it's like, hey, you know what? She's dead, I'm never masturbating to her again. Out of respect. Oh, yeah. I, I, I definitely haven't done that since, you know. Number eight, do you see? 8A, lower berth. 8B, upper berth. So they got, what, three tiers to sleep on? Jeez. So wait, is this lady Peter Cushing's little... Little... I have no ticket and I have to get out of Shanghai. I'm sure I can make it worth your while. The young lady's in trouble. She's got a nice little dress on. Couldn't you... Couldn't you double up with somebody else? Hey, do like that dress. Can we shoot yeah, them all? Whoa. Good hop up. You gotta hop in the ladder and climb way the fuck up there. Go to bed. Jesus, man. Yeah, it's certainly not handicapped accessible. I would I would fall off on a little bit. Yeah, that's the worst. Like, that'd be my fear of, like, sleeping on the top bunk. I mean, I like the bottom bunk because it has this, like, fort vibe, but, like, yeah, the fear exactly. of, like, the fear of the top bunk falling on you. <laughs> it's like, ugh. <laughs> your, your coach mate is, like, some huge fat ass. Yeah, the problem when you're in prison is you don't have a say in the matter. Oh, yeah, you do. <laughs> if you want the top bunk, you just beat the shit out of the other guy and say, I got top bunk. Well, it depends. Like the, the spot I was in, the the guards actually signed it to you. Oh, Let's so if the guard the guards like saw you like traded or whatever, they'd be like, "Hey, no." Yeah, exactly. They Even if it was like pull. mutual, like, "Hey, he yeah, wants to be exactly. on the bottom." The guards control everything. Well, then on that case, <laughs> we'll make sure you never sleep that way if that's what you want. <laughs> it's like my brother when he like says he's like, "I got a new uh, class for a new school year teacher." Yeah. 
Oh my god! What the, the hell is that? It's alive somehow! Mm. And it's very sensual. So it's a. Uh... Was that? So we can't break. <laughs> But anyway, I am I pro yeah, he's like, I hope not. Jesus. That'd be quite a pickle if it's got superhuman strength. Or even just problem-solving skills if it's able to, like, pick the lock somehow. Christ. Oh, no! Oh. <laughs> it does! With a match? No. Hell no. Please not. <laughs> oh, something metal. Here we go. A nail. This is so, this is so badass. I'm so angry right now. How is he able to do this? <laughs> is he bending the nail? What the fuck? How does he know to do this? What? Now I am. I'm interested now, okay? So anyway, my, my brother would say, <laughs> hey, all you kids, like, they'd all get into the class and they'd all sit in their friend group and they'd all be chatting at the beginning of class the first day of the school year. My brother would be like getting to know everybody. He'd be like, oh yeah, you guys are all friends. He'd be like, yeah. Who else is your friend? They raise hands. He'd be like, us. We're all friends. He'd be like, cool. All right, you sit over there, and you sit on that corner, and you sit over there. <laughs> like he's gonna start separating them. Okay. Glow red eyes. Glow in red eyes. He's a Terminator. At that point, you just shit your. What, what the hell? Whoa. What yeah, the fuck? <laughs> okay. Yeah, yep. whoa. So that's what happened to that other guy. Yeah, well, except he wasn't bleeding from the eyes. It thing, is but... some kind of supernatural thing. What the hell? Criminy. Terminator. Jesus. This dun, dun, is way dun. scarier than the Terminator. This thing's like a Medusa. This is, like, bad. <laughs> I thought this was going to be a killer monkey on a, on a, on a train. Oh, I boy. didn't realize it was going to be some kind of, uh, you know, Super Saiyan <laughs> psychic chimp. The dog. Even the dog knows it. Hey, Even man, just because the dog, dog needs a bath, I mean, you're you're probably not as not any less smellier than the dog, honestly. Resputin. Sure of yourself, aren't you? The blue one with the dick all day. I'm like, if this guy blew so much that he was on the train, then why'd you board the train for? <laughs> These guys definitely travel with style. I don't understand. I mean, I feel like Rasputin's kind of just bringing down the, the the vibe of the party, you know? Talking about yeah. the stink from hell <laughs> constantly. Making the dog cry. She's afraid of something. It's you, dude! Tell me, you creepy brother. bastard. Yes. Which do you think I should wear for the English one? The red or the blue? Enough. No, it's true. The dog's freaking out. Trust the dog. Wear the blue. It's apparently safe from those satellite laser weapons that are starting all those alleged wildfires. Oh, yeah. Wear blue. I like how Oprah Winfrey was able to paint her roof blue just in time to protect herself. That's why her house didn't burn down in Hawaii. I also like the balls of that woman to demand we oh my God. put our own tax money, our own money into her and to funnel it into her fucking shell organization. How about no? I was up there. Is that the gorilla? Is Bigfoot whistling? Why do you call? Yeah. So I said, what's up with this fucking uh, creepy ass whistling? Oh, it's what I was playing. Someone's a fan. <laughs> I'll just keep playing it. No big deal. <laughs> yeah, that, that's, um... I'm not sure if that's a real train or not, no. I think it is a miniature because it's like... Go. Think about how expensive it would have been in 1970 to just fly a helicopter just to get that stupid aerial shot, you know? I never thought about that. Yeah, just have a one little model train. You get all your exterior shots of this model train. Yeah. Because, like, I was thinking, Good like, point. why don't you just film a real train? But honestly, the logistics of, like, well, we got to film the train in all these different, um, you, you know, types of environments, of like mountains and snowy the terrains. I haven't the remotest idea. What about you? Oh, I there's another little animal. Yeah, it wasn't CGI back then. <laughs> but why, you know, why did that lady get to hold her dog 
in the cabin with her, and all these other animals get to go in cages. Dude. Fortunately, he was interrupted. Yes. It's emotionally supporting animal fire. <laughs> Why are you so worried about it being opened? It, it may be my fault. I so wait, I don't understand. I thought he open. broke out. Curious. It was no concern of yours. Or of yours. Good night. Yeah, everyone's like, why is uh... Another missing? It's time we uh -oh. open this box. You will do no such thing. Hmm. The open the box. He demands oh. it. Damn. I guess he, he didn't got... escape. He just managed to have some guard look through that peephole. <laughs> and he got all medusa Oh my... Okay. What?! What a, what a douchebag. He threw the key away. <laughs> Go ahead. You will not open my monkey crate. No, now you're going to unlock it permanently. <laughs> now you won't be able to lock it back up. Ugh. Plus with an axe. I like how he just got that done in one little swoop. Little, that's a crack shot with that axe. We're letting you out, Mr. Yeti. That has one badass axe. Uh -oh. He's a little Gimli train guy. God. Are they gonna scared. Oh, no! I knew it. He did escape. Yep. He switched the bodies. We've got to question you, Mr. Lee, about this body. <laughs> what was in there? I told you, a fossil, part ape, part man. It lived two million years ago. Are you... Part ape, right? part man? There's an ape that lived two million years ago. Got out of that crate, killed the baggage man, and I put mean, him in there. Anim man and ape, ape are kind of the same animals, so away. like... Uh. Yes, I am. It's alive. It must be. Lock him up. It's alive. We'll search yeah. The and find it. It's Whatever. alive! <laughs> <laughs> well, sure it is. Give me your best <laughs> it's alive right now. It's alive! It's alive! <laughs> it's alive! It's part eight, part man. <laughs> It'd be cool to see Frankenstein one day just be like, dude, it's like, it's alive. <laughs> whoa. Whoa, dude, he's alive. Oh, whoa, check it out. <laughs> they're always just like peeping, hoping they're going to catch someone masturbating or Doing the dirty. Yeah. My question is, how the hell did you kill this thing? I mean, the, the, the guns even hurt it? I mean, yeah. I don't know. I mean, before uh -oh. I thought this was just a big dumb monkey. Now I'm realizing it's some kind of super genius, telepathic, mind controlling, brain melting super monkey. Not the kids, you, you sick bastard. Ooh. He's not looking good. And also, he has no lips for some reason. Jesus. The guards are really? searching. The children. Is he going to choke her? Or what the hell is he doing? Just smell my hand. Yeah, he's just like sticking his hand in her face. Like, smell <laughs> my wiping hand. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I wish I had a nose. Is he good, good, fucking give her wet willy or something? I mean, nah, she's not worth it. I'm out of here. I mean, it was easy prey, so. I can't get on any more lists. <laughs> like, you want to feel sympathy for the bad guy? Maybe a murderer, but he's not a. Like, why is his killer. hair covered with, like, silver spray paint? I don't... Is that supposed that's, to be, like, uh, snow? That's what I was thinking, but she, is she melted by now? Yeah, why? What? He's all sparkly. Ah. It's a goddamn Terminator. <laughs> also, that rifle is not very useful in these tight corridor hallways, you oh, know? Uh-huh. Like, if you had to shoot someone in one of those rooms... I don't know, dude. Why don't you have a sidearm, pistol, a sword, a knife? A 
Say something, you dummy. Yeah. Oh, they probably couldn't give him any lines because <laughs> you have to get paid more. But yeah, you'd be like, use, use the fucking bayonet. It's more effective. Ray, Ray, are you okay? <laughs> Was that you screaming, Ray? Are you all right? Say something, Ray. No. Oh no, his, Ray! His eyes. Oh, I love when the snow is like made out of like crumpled up styrofoam or whatever the fuck. <laughs> There's a model train again. They're showing the exact same footage from last time. I mean, I don't know if it's the exact same footage, but yes, it's definitely a model it's, train. They're just filming it's, it's going around. Footage? Like he's just filming around, going around. A, they're just filming going around like a little uh, room, and each corner of the room has like a different like landscape. I'm sorry. It's basically like a giant model train. Nerds. Model train. Oh, everyone's, everyone's having a nice dinner. So. Good evening. Traveling in luxury. Mm -hmm. What is she eating? Just a chopped up apple? So. Yes, at the governor's palace, General. Yeah, we got a potato, a potato maybe? Or it's all. It's like, I didn't like it, whatever it was. Take it away. Of course I. I'll have some coffee. Yeah, I'll have some coffee tonight. Maybe I'll maybe I'll eat some Adderall and stay up all night and do some real editing. Yeah, I've been there. <laughs> Imagine if I, you know. Oh damn. no! What's the matter? Even the the monkey killed the fish too. Oh <laughs> damn it! God. I think it's just because you boiled him, and you know. <laughs> boiled. Oh, so that's why he's getting an idea. Yeah. Like, for some reason, like, looking at the guy's eye, monkey's eyes boils your brain and causes your eyes to turn white from heat. Is it true you're a doctor? Maybe that's why Scorpion has those solid white eyes from Mortal Kombat, because he's out in hell in the nether realm. Yeah. Yeah, maybe that's a cool... There's a cool little... Like, you go to hell and your eyes are white, because, like, the hot... The heat. <laughs> yeah. Oh, boy. It's a lovely day in hell. It's only 370,000 degrees. You didn't hear anything. Excuse me. Keep your nose out of it. Yeah, it's like, uh, you guys, you're trying to alarm the whole train. You understand people gossip, right? And you understand we can still hear you. You're just literally standing like six inches to the left. Excuse me. And then you stand like right next to them and then have your conversation just standing up. YouTube, this, you can't hear us. God, this is Ellen. This is Ellen Page in thirty years. God. <laughs> Sorry, excuse me, Elliot Page. My day is your day. You say her name. Huh. Very curious. A genetic defect. Close the freaky eyes. <laughs> yeah, really. He definitely okay. didn't have these freaky white eyes earlier today, ma'am. Scalper. Yes, cut the eyes open. Yeah, let's just slice oh. his eyeballs open and see what's going on. <laughs> his body's not even cold yet. What, We're gonna doing? fucking be cutting him Good open. Man. Oh, okay, so this is why they're teaming up. Christopher Lee is the, the fossil guy who had the monkey and and yep. uh, Vincent Price is some kind of uh, doctor. Don't get up, please. She's the hot chick changing outfits. I like how he still hasn't lost his appetite knowing that his killer ape is running loose on the train. <laughs> I mean, I guess you gotta fortify, prepare yourself for the battle to come. Yeah. I've eaten in worse circumstances in worse company, huh? Uh-huh. Ooh, hell wow. yeah. Peel that skull off. You are, Doctor. What was it, uh, Bone Tomahawk? <laughs> that scalping scene. He's still alive. Just because his eyes are white, they just assume he's dead. That box of bones, my darling, could have solved many of the riddles of science. He called it a box of bones. If the theory of evolution is confirmed, if the science Man. of biology is revolutionized, so the science of biology of is determined. I have heard of the very origin of man. They found the missing link. It's a fact, and there's no morality. So they're calling evolution immoral? Like, it's just nature. <laughs> Strange people in their weird religions and shit. And what about the baggage man? And that poor thief at the station? I mean, eh. they just, what about they died. 
they are dead. Yeah. What are you gonna do? <laughs> your creature is People dead. die in China all the time, ma'am. Probably. He's just drinking a big glass of Everclear. Grain alcohol. Baggage man. What was it? Uh, was that super high content? Yeah, I still tried stuff. I uh, got oh a bottle of it once. I dropped it by accident. It, it's ever clear. It it's terrible. Yeah. No. Yeah, they have they have it around here too. Yeah, of course. It's fucking the cheapest, most high potent alcohol on earth. It'll kill you. <laughs> like two hundred percent. It's highly flammable. <laughs> that's supposed to be a brain. Oh, that's the skull. Absolutely. Mm. It must be a mutation, a freak of nature. Dude, it boiled his brain. his brain. Yeah. Learning and memory are engraved on the normal brain. Really? Learning yeah. memory. Oh my god. Holy shit. Are you telling me this, this monkey is like absorbing the information the from your brain when it sucks the juice out of your eyes? Your god. That's awesome! <laughs> Holy crap. It just keeps gaining power then. So like Medusa, <laughs> like not only do you just turn into stone, but also Medusa like retains all your memory after it like kills you. Whoa. This thing is okay. definitely uh not to be fucked around with. What the fuck is it even called? Yeah, really. I like how the movie's just called Horror Express and they just keep calling well, it the thing, the fossil, the creature. Also, why does it come back to uh why does it come back to the body for anyway? Why is it sticking around the train? Why does it just hop off the train? Oh, I guess maybe because it's an Arctic Tundra? Yeah. Coming back for seconds. It's gonna do eat him or something? Sure. Pop it open. It's like the cookie jar. Come you know? in. We know, you're, we, we know you're gonna be, you know, yep. your mother's gonna know you were in there. I wouldn't be long. Gotta go use the can. I like that dress. Nice and green. It's very, uh, the Jade Dragon. And she's a little redhead. Huh. I'm totally pooping in there. Slow and menacing. Holy shit, too. It'd be funny if there was someone in that toilet and they just saw that woman just open and close the door real quick. <laughs> yeah. What the hell? Excuse me. Whenever I'm in a public restroom and someone like knocks on the stall or something, I'm always say, uh, I always say, uh, come back with a warrant. Gets a laugh every time. Light up the place. Yeah, so the body's still there. I mean, what the hell was the point of checking the body there for that ape creature? Are we gonna find that the brain has been stolen now? Ooh. I like how he's got teeth on his lips. It, uh, adds to the horror, what? I guess. Are you not? What's? Are you not seeing that? What's going on behind you? What is so important to stay safe? Is she some kind of? Is this like some kind of criminal caper going on at the same time? Hmm. Why? Red laces. Oh, that's what you oh. get for stealing, bitch. <laughs> No, not the oh, eyes. Oh, whoa, <laughs> so God. he doesn't even do that all the time. Oh, he's doing it again. He's boi boiling the brain. Oh, there's the blood. Show me how you get such great makeup done. <laughs> I will learn how to take such flawless cheekbones. That's, that's just a bad way to go. Damn. Yeah, yeah, I think so. Having a killer ape just staring you down and boiling your brain with his laser eyes. Yeah. It looks like the predator does it quicker. Vampires just bite your neck it and is. it's good to go, but it's this Dr. thing Wells. boils you. God. Dr. Wells is ready for love. Are you ready? Miss, are you all right? I thought you were going to come back to the room and shag me. 
It's very rude to leave my balls anticipating. <laughs> Damn cocktails. She's with Christopher Lee. I know it. <laughs> She's playing us both like fiddles. Uh, I keep forgetting. It's only has it's the left eye. The right eye is like shut, so it's so only now, staring you with one eye. <laughs> so now the ape is like stealing your money too, or whatever. Stealing the Miss, stealing what the lady there? was stealing. Miss, what's her name? Oh. Oh God, no! Don't look at his eyes. <laughs> or its eye. He sh shot through the door. Thank God. Oh yeah, he does only have one eye. Yeah. Oh, uh, keep shooting. I mean, it is kind of like, what the hell am I looking at here? Yeah. But now that that, after, after that time dead. is over, shoot now. <laughs> oh no, he's he's got. Oh him. He's, no! <laughs> he's getting it's jaundice. Got, it's goddamn scanners. <laughs> Holy crap, dude! Nobody look at this thing. Come on, get off one good round. Holy crap. <laughs> well, that was a cool movie, I guess, Chris. Oh, uh, damn. Now we're like halfway done for some reason. What the fuck? I mean, he shot it. Okay. It fell to the ground, but it's... You know, you know damn well, I think isn't dead. My God, mm. he's dead. Before we got to have sex. Yeah, I know. I was totally <laughs> ready for her to spend the night in my cabin, my little log lodge, my room. So wait, is the train not moving anymore? What's going on outside? Oh yeah, it is. All that styrofoam snow. <laughs> Come in. Wait. What did he find on his? Feeling better. Is there something wrong with his, his balls? Yes. Anything wrong? That woman who was killed. The engineer, you know, the uh, chess player. He told me that she was an international spy. Yes, I know. Oh, you do. Well, with that fact. That woman was killed. Was she was a I chess know. player. What do you think? Dr. Wells and I performed an autopsy on her. Her brain okay. was completely smooth, just like the baggage man's. Everything is smooth brain. Oh, no. oh. I'm only a policeman. Smooth brains. I, much education. Hmm. I guess we're a couple smooth brains, aren't we? Supposing oh, yeah. Creature Definitely. You killed. Suppose that creature, the one you killed. Directly from other people's brains and transferring them to its own. Okay. You mean it sucked other people's brains? Absorbed. <laughs> Jesus, to, this to the is eyes. so crazy. Yes, memories through the that eyes. First clue: the eyes go white. My okay. God. Your brains, all of your what are we gonna call this monster? Huh? This psychic, I... this psychic yeti. Much more so. The um. What did it take hmm. from me would have been added to the learning that it already had. Yeah. Spy. Well, he's guessing this thing is getting a certain set of skills. He keeps downloading skills like the fucking Matrix here. <laughs> Gorilla Zilla. I don't know. A fucking creature like that. I am. How would it ever die? How would it ever die? Exactly. What is it? I found this. The animal had The animal had Give it to me. So the animal had a bag. Right. Count Petrovsky. This was in the safe. What is it? Does it look like look like some red rope? Yeah. Oh God! Of course, it's this dude's fault. Something involving yeah. him. A damn evil preacher. You're telling me we couldn't trust the most evil-looking man on the train? French, English, but they're wasting our time. 
Okay. Why is he hanging out with this couple, too? Like, he's just... <laughs> what a weird party guest, you know? Like, yeah, it's gonna be me and the hot lady and uh, the creepy old priest guy. What happened to the girl? The spy? It looks like Robert Damn, De Niro in uh, Robert De Niro in Angel Heart. <laughs> That's what he looks like. Uh, but there's no more danger, Countess. He said the fossil would ever kill her. I put four bullets into him. I put four bullets into him. You think he and... can be killed with bullets? Well, yeah, haven't you seen uh, End of Days with Arnold Schwarzenegger? <laughs> he kills the devil with a bunch of machine guns. Well, it's like if you can't kill evil with bullets, then what's your plan, dude? Holy Drop water. crosses on it? Yeah. <laughs> well, does anybody have any holy water? No? Uh -oh. Okay, then who cares? Look, the candle went out. It's ominous. No. Oh. Uh -oh. All right, surely just a coincidence. Surely nothing to, you know, nothing to freak out about. Paintings fall off the walls of trains all the time. Yep. What in the God? Take the ape's eye. Yeah, exactly. I'm going to eat this bitch. That's some, uh, some good makeup back in the 70s, given that. I mean, that's probably a real eye from an animal. <laughs> Could very well be like a cow's eye. So they're going to examine the eye fluid under a microscope. Open. Yeah, this will give us all the oh. answers. Yeah. What the fuck? What the fuck? Okay, I guess it does give you all the answers. Yeah, I try to explain that to somebody. What? It's literally... So it's seeing the images of the last thing it saw. Okay. This is ridiculous. This would have been so much better if it was just a killer monkey. I don't. What is going? This is like an X Men movie. Hey, really? X Files. That's a superpower. Oh, that's a dummy. Pop that head open. Wait. Why does he keep caressing everyone's skull cavities? Not to mention, if the eye is gone, then how's he seeing? It's a different ape! A fuck? What's... It's a guy with an ape hand! Oh, uh -huh. it was guy with the mustache. He was looking at his hand, turning ape-like. I see. He's somehow... So this is some kind of virus? It's like a werewolf, too? It's I, like it's Jesus contagious? Christ. <laughs> the the layers of this creature. What? Is that a fucking dinosaur? It's a, bro a brontosaurus and pterodactyl. I've always thought brontosaurus was my favorite dinosaur. Is there any triceratops? That's. Oh. Be kind of cool if you look in eye fluid and stuff. Do you see like Hitler and the shit? <laughs> I like how they've only been on the train for a few oh, yeah. hours, and this is like her fourth costume change. Oh yeah. But look at the decor. Ah. <laughs> Fully stocked bar, a big brass plate. Incredible. Um. Oh, God. It's like incredible. This is not a map. It's not a map? What? It it's blood. Earth, seen from space. It's an Wait. alien? I hope I'm not. He said that. <laughs> he said that Earth's seen from space. <laughs> it, what the hell? It's so you just you pull out the eye fluid and you can just see a creature's past life? That's not how it works. Then there's no more danger. You're telling no, this... It's, uh, <laughs> it's, not, it's not from this planet. I was literally joking. I was like, what do they expect to see from the eye fluid? Like, you know, maybe some microorganisms of some kind? Some, some, hey, some hey, blood cells? Thinking. Instead, it's, it's like... like <laughs> yeah, if I just suck your eye juice out of a syringe and put it in a microscope, I'll be able to see what you saw. Like, your whole life will flash before my eyes. Yeah. Yeah, she looks Pujadrov. down. Pujadrov! Like, okay. Woo! Pujadrov's here! Yeah! This is where science trumps religion. He's always got his hands just hovering so delicately over his nipples. Hmm. What is that? That doesn't even look like Earth. That's what we're to believe. He's seeing the Earth. Ovaltine. It is the Holy Rain. On 
It's the what? You created your... Oh boy. No, dude, it's just a weird ape creature. There, from the creature's eye. Oh. Ew. It's gonna do eat it or something? Nonsense. It's nonsense! Eye. It's the eye of a giant killer psychic gorilla! No. And, um, that makes more sense, I guess. For the fall, before Satan was banished from the throne of God. Before Satan, the throne of God. Down from heaven and did see. Rubbish! I mean, I mean, I guess. Rubbish! Oh, there you go. Sex. They're all having sex. That was a metaphor. <laughs> and Satan looked down from the heavens and saw Earth. Uh, oh, okay. he's sure. eating that eye, isn't he? Gross. I'm telling you. He's gonna throw it out. Watch. Some of the bitch don't do it. Tonight on Fear Factor, you get to eat one <laughs> Satan's eye. Where is he? I don't know. He's gone mad. Pujardov going mad. Pff, classic Pujardov. Huh. Always doing stuff like that. I always tell the guy he needs to loosen up, man. He's just so stressed out. Always talking about the stink of evil. It's like, dude, we're on vacation, bro. We're on a train. Have a cocktail. Relax. Soon we'll be out of this hellish Arctic Chinese hellscape. <laughs> We're, we're uh, oh, I guess they're going to Russia, right? Is that where the train's going? Man, I guess so, huh? Ellen Page and Rosie O'Donnell successfully breeded and created this woman. Okay. Darn. Shit. Is it him? Oh no. He's turning into a monkey. Looking for the thief, Miss Jones? I mean, you know about it. The thief. Is that the most back Jones? Jones? Who's that guy? <laughs> you get back that eye, and there's a thousand rubles in it for you. A thousand rubles for an eye? There's something in it. It's all about the eye. Pictures. What? Pictures of what? Of Pictures what? Of the earth in prehistoric times. Um. Pictures of the earth seen from Oh, space. so that's the priest. Who else has seen He's got yeah. the eye right there. Dr. Wells, Professor Saxon, and that pretty countess. I see. <clears throat> the pretty countess. She's, She's telling him all the exposition. I mean, I still don't understand what the hell's going on. Oh, God. What the hell? It's his hand. Good God. That's why they always tell you to wipe with your left hand. Oh, yeah. Watch his eyes start going. Holy what... crap! Is that determining their eyes? No! These poor actors had to wear some very painful full eye contact lenses. Oh, yeah. The brain boiler. That's what we're... <laughs> the brain boiler. <laughs> There's your movie title. Horror Express. I mean, I don't. Know. Did, did like he evolve to switch bodies or something? What the hell going on? He's like turning into this gorilla thing. I don't understand. Then why him? Pity. It's the eye. Someone's gonna eat it. Come on. I've got my. The cow eyeballs, it's like the best part. It's a delicacy. Oh, he's gonna throw it in the burner. Damn. Are you going to Damn. Give me? Huh. You're going to give me. There's nothing in your head of any use. Yep. So, so we transferred. Okay. Did they transferred consciousness? What the f it's pretty sad that he's just literally like, I don't even want to kill you. Did you see anything? 
So before it died, it transferred its uh, its brain power into this guy. I don't know. I think maybe because he killed the guy, he killed the gorilla like in in the middle of it, trying to suck his eyes out. Maybe that's what happened. Or yeah, maybe the gorilla like chose like, hey, this is like my last chance. Yeah. It's like it's like uh, it gave up the the other body for a it's like new the body. Fallen or the thing. Yeah. Who else has seen such pictures? Doctor Well. <laughs> He's trying to pick off all, all the all witnesses. <laughs> and that pretty counts. Well, yeah. Saxon, yes. Nobody well, can know. <laughs> Nobody can know. <laughs> the banana rama zama. No one can know my secret. Wells, is this creature dead or not? <laughs> if it's it like, is, um, who killed Miss Jen? Exactly. I know. Was him. Do you have any idea? Look at his other hand, God damn it! Yeah, please show us your <laughs> left hand. <laughs> yeah, it's like, you know, they say, uh, you know, you get hairy palms, right? That's what he's got to say. Wow. No, I'm sorry. I have a problem. <laughs> I have an addiction. Yeah. Obviously, I'm a southpaw. Southpaw. My God, man, it's just self control. Oh God. Yeah, I would definitely freak out too if I saw someone do that. Yep. Hey, let me come in your office real quick. Close the door, turn off lights, turn around, and have fucking red eyes. <laughs> I'm out of here. Tell me who you are. Tell me what you are. Don't you see I'm in love with you? <laughs> Take me with you. Tell me. Wait, serve you? You, yeah. you just... You think it's the devil, you asshole? You wanna serve it? Religious... Religious dildos. I want to He's not a servant of God, he's a servant of whoever it's has like power. Yeah, really. What if there's a disease? I want, I want to serve You know, you. the pretty countess who doesn't say anything? Yeah, she is dead. attractive. The eyes... Why do the eyes go white? We already went over this, dear. Several hours ago. Get on board. Are those photographs? Oh. Now they're checking all the eyes. Do you think it's true what they say about those horrible white eyes? Oh, that part is true enough. <laughs> Of course, you're checking everybody who's uh, the one, the one person it is. He's got this beautiful dame with him sitting at the table talking to him, and all he wants to do is play chess. Your eyes. We must examine your eyes, too. This man is focused. Let's look in your eyes. What are you trying to see? Yeah, nothing. Yeah, really. Perhaps you should test for radiation or other invisible rays. Oh, great. I'll just pull out my invisible ray testing device that I brought on the train. Are you a scientist? An engineer, but I try to keep up with things. <laughs> That's to be admired. Okay. Inspector, I suggest you tell all these people to stay together in groups or in pairs. So that yeah, if anything does happen to anybody, pairs. then somebody can raise the alarm. My favorite On fruit. no account must anybody be left alone. Oh, we left alone, especially with that guy, uh, that got the mustache. But we're now because all the freaking characters, like, they, they don't have to think, they don't understand what's happening with this, this thing body hopping here. Good God, man, close this window. It is drafty. I like how even that little crumpled paper didn't fall off the fucking table. Even though this window is wide open on a moving train in an Arctic tundra. There should be like snow building up in this fucking train car, you know? Yeah. People investigating. Why is it so damn cold in here? God, who left this window open? Oh, this budget? poor bastard job. He, you know, these poor idiots have to just sit in this train station. What a job. the train. 
Dick, don't let me read it. It's my job to read it, not yours. Yeah, it's 1906, so. All right. Only the skilled newsreader is allowed to touch this. So <laughs> I'm going to read it for The train you. will be here in exactly um, seven <laughs> minutes ago. 14 minutes. 14 minutes. There you go. That's what it says here. After that, everyone's gonna die. Oh, I thought that was. Doesn't say it in words, Your Honor, but in code, it's like another language. I know about <laughs> telegraphs, little papa. I know about trains. I know about electrical currents. Okay. I know about that. That's what he You're does. He everybody. has sex in cages, and he knows things. Outside, All right. Even though I still believe in God, I. You made a fool of No, Your Jeez. Honor. I'm so confused. I wouldn't do that. Hmm. No, Your Honor. Tell me, little train, you idiots. You believe in the devil? Oh, God. Yes, uh, Your Honor. You believe in Satan? Oh, good. Send a telegram. Tell Are you the devil? Have, What's going uh, on here? He knows really? that a horse has four legs. Captain Kazan told him. But still, the devil must be still. afraid of one honest Cossack. Hmm? The devil must be afraid of me. I don't understand. The devil has one eye? <laughs> well, there's your recycled shot right there for you, blue collar. <laughs> I definitely saw that one before. Guy yeah, playing chess again, holy shit. You know how to measure it? How to measure gravity? Yeah. What I would like to know is can I gravity can measure be gravity. overcome? Uh, if you mean can man get beyond the gravitational field of the earth into space, not yet. Those but those tiny now. little chess pieces. Someday? There is a mathematics professor. His name is Cholkovsky. He has ideas about the rockets. Machines he has ideas, huh? huh. Mm -hmm. You know him? Do you know him? Cholkovsky. I mean, we used to date, but... He was like a father to me. Don't tell him I sent you. Why would a man like you be interested? Hey, oh, what, where'd you get that cool hairy glove? <laughs> oh, God. Now what? Is, is other lady still sleeping? <laughs> With this hairy left hand <laughs> <laughs> What do you think is behind all these so this this thing is still messing with the damn professor. Yeah, like I said, this guy has no problem just moving about with his business, despite the crazy shit happening on the train that he knows about. Some form of intelligence came to the Earth from another planet. Okay. The atmosphere of the Earth was new to it, different. The atmosphere of the Earth was different. True. Well, By entering into the body and brain of an Earth creature. Hmm. The fossil I found and brought with me. And this thing from another planet survived the fossil? So it's like a parasite then. Exactly. Go oh. I mean, I the guess animal it's... that you shot was hmm. only the host. Oh, exactly. it's like when the thing. Died, it's like a parasite. The alien intelligence yep. transferred. I like how he's not even going to turn around and look host. at this man. I'm it's just going to go back to writing in my little hmm. journal. In someone... On this it's train. alive. Someone oh. on this train. Oh, very good you're very good at that. Except who is now the host? And that's not in this very room. Thought this might come in handy. Oh, good idea. Two of you together. Hey, do me that's a favor fine. and shoot this guy standing behind what me. He's clearly the monster. Monster? <laughs> monster? They're British, you know. That's a good line. <laughs> monster? We don't <laughs> British. Talk about such things. <laughs> can't be a monster, I'm British. Say the creature or the, uh, 
the entity, the organism, the beast. That's about the white eyes. The lights were on. So the lights were on. They were off. Okay. Are you sure? Positive. It was dark. I put the lights on, and that's when I found. So she didn't die. I like how the creature yeah. just let her sleep blissfully the while she while he murdered that other guy. Yeah. Boiling his brain Master. and his skull. This guy. Master, don't leave without me. I love you. <laughs> Can I? Why didn't you just kill him then? Why don't you numbers? just like as the creature just like go in his body since he clearly wants it so bad? <laughs> yeah, really. Also, can you infect more than one person at a time or no? Probably not. Dude, yeah. that was a cartoonish looking gun. That looked like the Roger Rabbit gun. With the cartoon <laughs> bullets. Uh oh. Shoot him. I'm gonna bitch slap you with my hairy hand if you don't start talking. This steel at high temperatures. What happens to it? Well, it certainly won't melt from jet fuel, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> Ten or twelve thousand degrees. Where on earth? Ten or twelve thousand degrees. Nowhere. Uh -huh. What what temperature does jet fuel burn at? Nowhere on Earth. He's kind of slowing down. He's gonna show his hairy hand. Oh, dude, we're at the station. Oh, we can finally hang out with these some snow. army dudes. Oh, I guess they know there's something happening because they got alerted, right? Hey, trouble on yeah. the train. Killer monkey loose. Killer need... brain boiling parasite loose. <laughs> that could be possessing other passengers. Everybody show us your left hand. I am in Siberia. Who's this guy? What was what movie was he in? I don't know. Oh, your I'm Count. Of course, the Count and the Countess are exempt from orders. Yeah. It's not how it works, though. But what about the uh, creepy church guy that came with them? He's... Peasants. Exactly. Peasants! You're all peasants. Goddamn peasants. Dude, I know this bald guy from some big movie. Looks like all the guy from Annie. I'm that's, that's what I'm, I'm thinking. Yeah. By foreigners. I'm not sure that though, man. but... He's the one who wouldn't let us get off the train. He's responsible. He's the one. Uh -oh. oh, it's Terry Savalas. I know the name, obviously. He was best known for... Kojak. Kelly's Heroes, Dirty Dozen. That's where I'm knowing him from. Everybody's under arrest. You. you. Who are the killers? Who? Who are the troublemakers? <laughs> Who's responsible for all this? Who are just... the foreign influencers? Huh? Damn, is it foreign influencers? Tell me these foreigners. <laughs> It's the damn Asians. So I guess they're oh, in right. Russia now, so... Yeah. The Russians are in charge. It's never a good thing. And it's cold outside, too. believe in free speech, don't you, huh? Huh. Well, not anymore. Nonsense, you'd investigate this property. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine that English being in free speech. What's crazy is America's now thrown more people in jail for uh, speech crimes than, than uh, England in the past three years. It's crazy. Come and get me, you sons of bitches. <laughs> I can't wait till I'm on trial for thought crimes and they start pulling up these dumb movies as evidence. <laughs> Exhibit B. This guy and his friend watched fucking Silver Bullet. Made fun of it. Made fun of the boy in the wheelchair over and over again. You're a monster. They made fun of the fact that this guy looks like Robert De Niro. 
Uh oh. That, that only works on evil people. Exactly. Oh, wait, it is working. Are they vampires? I mean, those are, those are, um, Dude, he is holding the gun the worst possible way. Like, so he can hold the cigarette too with the same hand? <laughs> no, don't do that. You said beware the wrath of Satan tonight, and I working for him. I think he means okay. the color satin. Like his, his... He just kisses across a dude. Yeah, man, I'm not, I'm not evil. Hold on. Is that a whip? It is, yes, it yeah. is. Come hang out in my private quarters. I guess most uh, cops just have like come hang out around. in the cage oh, that I rented out for this train ride. Also, why was he sleeping in that cage? Yeah, really. We must try to him. Ah. Him four times, five times. This shit hurts. It's leather too. Ooh, six times. Jesus. This isn't the first time this priest has been whipped. They whip themselves That's all true. the time. Give the pins. Well. It's like, sir, you killed him by accident. We how? <laughs> See, he's got that stupid dagger tucked in his belt, you. but if he fucking sat down, he'd stab Why? himself in the leg. He's mad. Who are you? I told you. I yeah, no, nobody's just fucking observant. This guy's like, I'm a policeman with one hand that likes to stay in my pocket. All right, deal with yeah. it. He's curious. Why is your hand still in your pocket for it? <laughs> your hand has been in this. Like, this is where they're starting to notice. Like, he. Oh, fuck. Oh, literally. Oh, when the night. The light goes off. His eyes turn red automatically. He busted him. Hell yeah. That was good. Oh, and it's like a silver blade. Is that why it's working? Yeah. I like how it's literally the devil. Show him. Damn. I thought this movie was about a killer ape. Turns out it was about a killer ape because that's why Satan. You saw his eyes. One look at them and you're dead. Yeah, don't look at his eyes. I guess he's going to go into his body. <laughs> yep. Hell yeah. Master, you can take me. <laughs> exactly. I haven't been yes. shot in the back twice and stabbed. Probably you can take, to me. take my unwounded body. Come, Come into me, Satan? <laughs> Jesus, <laughs> phrasing, bro! <laughs> Satan, come in me! Come in me, Satan! Oh my god. Okay. I want to feel you coursing inside me. Anything that moves near that door, kill it! It's like that Cartman when he makes a Christian feel? rock band. <laughs> it's like, look, it sounds like you love Satan. Of course I do. No, no, it sounds like you're like in love with Satan. Like you want to have sex with him. <laughs> yeah. There comes the eyes. Ugh. Come in, my ass, Satan. Oh. <laughs> Feels yes, good. Enter me. Look at him. He's all happy. <laughs> Feels good to get possessed by evil. Oh, yeah. Oh my god, Satan's coming inside me right now. It's, it's the, better than I even imagined. The Charlie Manson story. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Someone shoot him in the head while he's doing his weird little Satan orgasm dance. Yeah, really. This guy's way too much into it. Dude, he's like, I wish I didn't go into his body. He's like, likes it too much. <laughs> <laughs> Part of the fun of possessing someone is you possess someone who doesn't want to be possessed. Oh, uh, is his is, is his right hand gonna turn uh, weird too? This is how blue collar wakes up every night after he does Uber. <laughs> yeah, it's true. Wake up off the floor with red eyes. Palms are all hairy. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Shoot wildly into the train. Yeah, wait till you see the thing move first and it should. Yeah, like we're wasting all of our we, bullets, we guys. All. Exactly. It's okay. Bubba da bubba da bubba da. Here it comes. Yeah. The red eyed De Niro. It's on. 
So I'm gonna stare at one of you. That's it. One needs like what? Half a second? <laughs> Let's move pretty fast. Listen here, fucker. <laughs> Wait for it. Something happened, please. <laughs> it's like the tension. He's gonna the pop up behind him, pop up around. There we go, pop up behind yep. him. Yep, he did. Yeah, that was instant too, Jesus. This is like some Shang Tsung shit. I got another guy. Dude, this red eyed, are growing. Yeah, red eyed demon man. And Chris really did tell you guys, don't look into his eyes. Rasputin needs an ass butin. <laughs> it's like you think just close your eyes and tackle him to the ground. No! Oh! Damn, he's just killing efficiently. Oh! <laughs> Quick, I need to get my microscope. Yeah. Look that a whole friggin' police force. She's got my tea, my crumpets. He always kills in the dark. He can't play his little tricks in the strong light. That's very observant, ah. actually. That's true. You, you've never seen, oh uh, yeah, you never had his um, his red eyes turned uh, huh. must light out. This guy's giving me uh, Zoltar vibes from the movie Big. <laughs> yeah. Why would you look into his eyes for you? Not the Ukrainian prime minister. Yeah, it's, it's, like, it's like we just seen this thing wipe out like 20 of your fucking men. It's like it's, you got one defense against it. <laughs> Close your eyes, you prick. Yeah, but this guy's a badass. He's going to be able to like provide one wounding blow in his final moment like a samurai <laughs> warrior. One determined act. Oh, never mind. He sucks. I'm so. He's just a big drunk idiot, like everybody else. Oh god, okay. I really am overindulged on the brain <laughs> memory juice. I am stuffed, baby. I see how yeah, that's a lot of information he's downloaded. It's like fucking how many people have died so far? Like nine or ten? Shit, I lost count. And that's like seven people right there. Yeah. Go on now. We know I survived because I'm narrating the film. <laughs> I basically, I basically have a immortality blanket because all plot armor. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> the trick's not working, there, pal. Hey, I'm totally not evil. Totally not possessed by the devil. You know. It's like, dude. In spite of everything, Pujado had a certain affection for you. Wait, you talk about yourself in the third person. Yeah, yeah. Pujardo, you're seeming really sweaty and chill and talking Even about yourself and... Dear God. Who wants revenge for Pujardo? You were kind of an asshole to the Pujardo. <laughs> oh, oh, boy. Of course, oh, yep. Hey, let me show you something. Dude, you could remake this movie and make it legit fucking terrifying. Yeah. Like, this right. story is wild. I've never seen anything like it. I, I'm digging it. <laughs> Crazy. It's funny how, like, he's, like, looking, he's, like, looking down and just, he's... damn. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't really convey the fact that they're eye contact because, like, yeah, it looks like he's staring at the dude's nipples. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> he's dead. See, like, if, if we had that camera angle when she was on the floor, then it would look like he was looking down at her on the ground, maybe. It's too late to kill Pajardov. Pajardov's in here with us. Damn. He was in love with you. I mean, to be honest, probably everyone on the train is kind of in love with this girl. She's gorgeous. Why did he hesitate? Shoot, shoot the fucker. I would have shot him instantly. I'll give him yeah, time. Yeah, you were able to kill that ape, no problem. It would be a mistake to kill me. 
Bam! That's what you say when someone says that. It's a mistake to do what you want. You should kill the bad guy. Right in the middle of a sentence. Just like, don't even listen to this shit. Blow his head off. Another galaxy. Makes sense. Another galaxy. I came with others like myself. I was left behind. An accident. I survived in protozoans. Fish. Vertebrates. Good God. Imagine that. The history of your planet is part of me. Okay. Pull the trigger and you will end it. Damn. Dude, I yeah, don't was... give a shit at all about that. In fact, what the fact that you do? told me that makes me even want to kill you even more. Gives me, like, me more go. bragging rights. That's not possible. Like, the fact that it I ended possible. some million-old, million-year-old, uh, I will demon species away. from another galaxy. Yeah, which is bullshit. Yeah. Just, look, just elect me your ultimate ruler and god, and I will promise to be cool. Just don't kill me, and I promise I'll, like, okay. bring you about world peace. I promise oh, wait, I won't is, is boil he... anybody else's brains. Dude, he's gonna bring back the, the, all his victims? Yeah, dude, That's he's scary. got, like, remote control. Dude. This is wild Holy shit, shit, dude! <laughs> it's kind of hard to rip on a movie when I'm just legitimately enjoying it. <laughs> What's kind of the like question? It's like, okay, since you've woken up out of that ape creature, like, what what is it that you want? <laughs> it's like if you were left yeah, and it's your... like before you were the you were the ape creature, you were like just frozen in a cave. It's like, yeah. what, what was your plan? Like, how'd you exactly. get there? Like, what? <laughs> Boy. Here it comes. Yeah, fucking don't look at him. Close your eyes, just run. That's the other thing, is he's Smart. pretty useless if he doesn't fucking try to look at you in the eyes. Yeah, it's like you only have one attack, that's the same. <laughs> the red yeah, eyes. Yeah, thing. right here would be creepy. I'd be like, um Attack of the Smooth Brains. I'm gonna kill them again. Get your fucking boil brain hands off me, you weirdo. This way, my lady. Help me kill, darling. Help me murder. Oh. Had to kill all of them again. <laughs> God damn it. See, I'm also I'm also on a train right now in the transatlantic, so that's why you're getting buffering issues, folks. Sorry. <laughs> He's a sword fighter, so. Ooh, penetration? Oh, More phallic references? This film is loaded with them, by the way. Oh, yeah. Hey, give me a kiss. I mean, really, it's like you just think that you're putting all these, like, zombie soldiers out of their misery, you know? Yeah. Oh. No one's checked on the conductor this whole ride. He doesn't. He's not even aware there's like anything going on. His job is just to move the train forward. <laughs> okay, well, let's see. damn, the zombies are still alive. There's a lot of them. Yeah. Does he kill, like, also, yeah, people? like home girl and the bag, the old lady and the baggage claim guy. Like, are they all gonna come back alive too? Good question. What to find out? What about the ones with their heads get carved open from the autopsies? Yeah, really. Yeah, let's go hide under the train. Sexton, thank God. Too many questions. Thank God you two are here. Why? What? Oh, we can lock ourselves in the room. Oh, we're gonna disconnect the train. Very broken arrowy. <laughs> yeah, really? You're the devil, yeah. Ain't it cool? I mean, what the hell telegraph would they be sending? When it goes through the switching point. Moscow says uh, the train is possessed by demons. Killing everybody on board. 
what it says. Maybe there's a war. <laughs> That's what it says. Maybe it's war. You follow your orders. Nowadays, people would just. People just question that wouldn't do it. Oh, so they're gonna disconnect the last train and then tell them to blow up the fucking train that goes it forward. I see. Yeah. Before you kill the creature. What? What's happening? <laughs> I'm so confused. Oh, they going to shift it. Oh, it's going off the cliff. Yep. All of it. That's, that's just part of it. No! There's your model train. <laughs> Damn, the train landed on a landmine. What are the odds? Yeah, really. So basically everyone the, uh, everyone went to the back of the train so that they'd be safe. Oh god, just imagine if it still fell off. You'd fucking... Oof. All right, everyone off the train car now. Don't look at the side. I wouldn't. I would not hang off that edge. I would get off the train and then maybe look off the edge of the cliff. Yeah. Ooh, it's really cold. Huh. Get the fuck out of here. Maybe we can warm ourselves down there by the train wreckage fire. It's still whistling for it, guys. Is that the end of the movie? Just ends like that? Yeah, I guess so many sense, of these uh, old monster movies are just like monster, monster dies, the end. Like there's no there's the Earth too. There's no prologue scene of us like seeing them in Russia enjoying their vacation a week later. It's always yeah, really. just like, hey, the monster's dead, the movie's over. So Finn, yeah. the end. <laughs> um, yeah, that was actually surprisingly good, and I would love a remake or soft yeah. reboot or sequel. Where the creature's yeah. back. What would we even call this creature? I fucking got me, man. I, Let me look it up. Yeah, I mean, surely this 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 monster has a name in lore. Uh, like it's yeah, it's the, basically the devil, the horror express monster. I mean, um, was it, it's it's an alien, so it's just called the creature. That that is yeah. not good. Uh, it's uh, the alien, also known as the creature, the main antagonist from the horror express. Nah, dude, we've got a better... We've got to come up with a better name for this fucking thing. Christ. No, that's not a good name. That's already taken. Um, <laughs> let's see. Um, yeah, the, the... Something about the brain boiler. The the broiler. I don't know. I mean... <laughs> the broiler. I don't know. I mean... The... the like, who is the... What's the man he... Pajarga... Pargajov? What was his name? Pajargo. Pajargov. Yeah. Pajargov. <laughs> yeah, the Pajargov creature, I guess, is better, because, like, you gotta you gotta narrow it down. But I want to see that remake for sure. Um, I agree. Well, wait. Hang on. How do I do this now? Oh, I know. I will turn <laughs> this off, pull up this, press play. Goodbye, everybody. Um, <laughs> thanks for watching. Be sure to comment, like, and subscribe. October 5th. See you tomorrow, October 6th. Uh, I don't know what we're watching, but you'll deal with it.